if you're joining us from another video, if you're joining us for the first time, hello! My name's Abby And that's my son Blake. Uh, he collects the Zorro robotic fish. We have for the video today the Zorro robotic jellyfish. Now these look super cool. They came in the box with this large tank and it is really big. The tank comes folded up like a tea towel. You have to unfold it and then to make it circular and stand up you slip this provided green cord through the top. It can be a little fiddly as it does get stuck but I managed to do it with a little wrangling and then it took five bowls of water to fill to this level here. I cannot express how big this actually is, but I will show you when we get round to it. Now, here is the box set. I could not do the unboxing on video camera as first I had to make the tank, then I had to fill the tank, and this little guy here does need to be charged. So my son has called the jellyfish champion. He's really cool. He's got these rubbery, tentacles they feel quite delicate so I'm not going to pull on them um he's held in his recharge station by magnets when he needs batteries you put him onto this he can be used as a nightlight you need to recharge him with four AA batteries these are not provided in the package so you make sure that you buy four AA batteries before you bring the product home to your children otherwise they won't be able to use it <laughs> He takes 40 minutes to charge up. We've been charging him for about an hour. Now, my son has these fish. This is Stinky. This is Pinky. And this is Nemo. We've put some of the coral into the tank already that we came with some of the fish sets. And here is the net. Now, he's going to put each of the fish into the water for us. Okay, sweetheart, put some of your pets into the water for us. Okay. What? One okay. at a time. Pinky first. Let Pinky go. Okay. Okay. So you people, what's in the, the what's in the fish go in as I put it in? See what's doing it swimming. Yep. And see how large the tank is. In comparison to my hand, it is amazingly large. Okay, sweetie, put in Stinky. Because Pinky needs her friend. Uh, you're gonna know what I'm putting stinky in, so time to stick him in there. Whoa! Oh, it's alright, sweetheart. Okay, now let's put in Nemo. Oh, it's alright, sweetie, put in Nemo. Okay, I'm gonna sew, I'm gonna sew, but I'm gonna put in Nemo. Now, Nemo's so a little low battery, so he doesn't flip very fast. Well, he is at the moment, he's going for it, but he does kind of get a bit tired. All right, so let's test out Champion the jellyfish and check out what he does, sweetheart. Put Champion in. Take him off his little station, good boy. Okay, and put him right in the middle. Let's see how the what the jellyfish after does. I talk to the, oh, after I talk, uh, this is how we fish. Got tentacles. It got a yacht, and it's an, and 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 it's and and its name is and its name is Sampian. So I'm gonna put the jellyfish in. All right. So when he hits the water, he starts making lots of colours. I'm just gonna film from the side here. So you can see how deep the water is. Now let's see if he goes up and down. At the moment he's just bobbing across the surface with his flippers. Does he go up and down? Maybe he just bobs along the top. Come on champion, you're a jellyfish, dive! Maybe they just bob around the top. Oh, hang on, honey. Don't fish him out yet. I'll just film him for a little bit and see if he dives down. Maybe you need some encouragement. Honey, just let me, I know he's meant to dive down and so we're hopefully going to capture that on film when he goes down. 
I'm poking him underwater at the moment. He's going straight back up. <laughs> So as you can see, the tank provided is really large and it is really cool looking. I mean, he's just kind of bobbing around the, the top. I'm sure that he, um, hang on sweetie, I'm sure he's meant to go down at some point. Once he goes down, you can poke at them all you like. Oh, Nemo's attacking him. Oh no, he's caught Stinky. Stinky's stuck in his tentacles. Okay, okay. So they are really cool toys. Oh, he's diving. He just tried to dive under. I think it's the um, Fisher kind of affecting him. <laughs> but he is meant to dive under the water. Maybe if I film from this side. I'm gonna force him under. Go under! There we go. Oh, he's going straight to the top again. So as you can see, the fish are really lively. They they basically swim around and around and around and they go up and down. Um, you can get these fish called sharks, I believe. I've heard of them. I haven't seen them, but I want to get one for my son. Now, the sharks are the bad fish because they purposely seek out the robotic fish and they look to attack them. And when they've caught them, the fish stops moving or something like that. I, I haven't actually seen one. But when I do, we will review it. So the jellyfish doesn't seem to be doing much. I am sure that they dive under. I have seen them dive under before. Maybe our one just likes to float across. The oh, no, he's going under a little there. There we go. He started to go under and now he's going back up top. So they do dive under and up and up. I can see this being really amazing in an aquarium because he looks so cool and we love the robotic fish. Oh look he's going under. Yep, yeah, I'm sure it's because the fish are attacking him that he's not going up, so I would too. So Nemo is currently fighting their sea enemy. Now if you love toys please subscribe. We love to open toys here. We love to share and um, we would love to know if you have a robotic fish yourself. We're going to be getting a robotic shark as soon as we can find one. And we are hoping to get the robotic turtle. Is that right, sweetheart? Yes. We want a robotic turtle. And maybe get a jellyfish that likes to dive under a bit more. <laughs> because I have seen them in the aquariums where they go up and down. Our guy just kind of likes to flip it around the top. So he's obviously a surface dweller. <laughs> Thanks very much for watching. Um, we're going to be doing a few robotic pets this week. Uh, feel free to join us. Bye-bye. See ya.